everybody and welcome to my channel. Hey, this is Juanita. Oh my God, the day has arrived. I'm finally going to get to phase two on this pergola. Yes, it's been a long road coming and I'm sure you guys have been waiting to see this. Um, my flagstone, it's arriving next week. It has been confirmed, so I'm excited. I'm, I'm so ready to get this started. So. I'm gonna go get my tools and let's get started. Okay, you guys, well, I've got my weapons of choice. And before I get started, I just wanna let you know that I'm gonna be clearing everything out and uh, taking out the bamboo. And let's see how far we get with that today. And with that being said, this is dedicated to my father. I look into your eyes and see we're out of time. I guess no one's to blame, nobody crossed the line. I guess we're close to fast, maybe we got too high. This here, it comes from uh, the peelings off of the eucalyptus tree that we have back here, and uh, it makes great kindling. Come to my 
Turn the tide Let the water go where it wants to go You can run and hide You can bury yourself in 
Oh my god, I didn't think I was going to be able to do that. That was a lot of work. <laughs> but I managed to do it. You know what? Who needs a gym, right? When you've got a backyard like this to do. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, just to give you guys a little bit of history. When I first started doing uh, this backyard and I started removing the bamboo, the bamboo was literally, uh, I would say probably a foot deep in, if not more. I'll uh, link up a picture at the very end of what this uh, yard looked like before I started uh, taking any bamboo out. But yeah, it was a lot of work then. And little by little throughout the years, I've been chopping back. And then about, uh, I guess about, a year ago, we had this pergola uh, put in. And uh, when we had that done, well, water doesn't get underneath it. So it really doesn't serve any purpose to keep it. So that's why I'm removing it. Just so if you're curious. But yeah, <laughs> it's a lot of work, but you know what? It's gonna be well worth it at the end. I wasn't, my intentions wasn't to move all this brick over here. It was just going to, I was just gonna to try to work around it. But uh, you know what? It's time to make that over. I kinda of contemplated on whether to redo that part or not. And uh, you know, why not? I'm doing a makeover, right? <laughs> so I might as well demo the whole thing. And uh, yeah, and start now. The water 
um, I don't know, what do you call that, um, uh, uh, the gutter, uh, spout comes down over in this direction, so it, uh, spills out, so I'm trying to get all the water drained away from the, from the home, so, um, that's the reason for having this built up and having a plant there so that it soaks it up and it doesn't filter into the house. Uh, but um, I'm going to try doing something different maybe down the road, but for now I'm going to leave it out here. Anyway, got to get back to work. So let's see how much further I can get. I'm gonna put the ladder up there because I've got bamboo way up there. I don't know if I can reach it. I'm not that tall. <laughs> My ladder's not that tall. So, uh, wish me luck. Okay, guys, I've got all this area cleared out and now I'm ready to power wash. So, I don't know how I'm doing for timing, but I'm gonna power wash before the day is over. <laughs> so, hope you guys are enjoying this video. If you are and I forget to mention, please subscribe, share it with your friends and family. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Please leave me your comments below. And, uh, <laughs> had something in my mouth, sorry. Um, but yeah, 
Leave me your comments below. Hey you guys, wait a minute. <laughs> Well, before I get started with pet washing, my chickens are dying to have their treats, their mealworms. They are being so impatient. I mean, they are literally jumping up to get this bag. Uh, so I'm going to feed them, put them in their uh, coop, and then we're going to get started on power washing. Okay, come on, girl. <laughs> I shouldn't tease them like that. I'm gonna put them on the grass. Okay, ladies, you guys ready? You ready? Okay, would you guys be? <laughs> is this yours? Is this yours? What is that? Is that mealworm? Is that real mealworm time? Yeah? Okay. Can you? I, I wish I could make you guys sit. Over here, that's here, right there. There you go. Come here. No, 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 no. Let her, let her, let her have her own. Come here. Come here. They are being little pigs. Okay, ladies, come on. Let's go in your coop. Hey you guys, it's been a while since I've power washed and used this machine, but I think I have it all plugged in, right? So let's get to power washing. <laughs> It would really help if I turned the water on. <laughs> like I said, it's been a while since I've power washed, so bear with me. Okay, you guys, well, you guys know what power washing is all about, so I'm not gonna put you guys through the whole thing. I will just show you the end result. So, uh, I'm gonna turn off the camera for now, and then I'll be back. It's gonna do it for me tonight. I was able to at least power wash the stairs and this part of the house and the barbecue area. I did do a little bit on the house, but uh, it's gonna take a little bit of elbow grease, I'm afraid. You know, a little scrubbing with soap and water by hand as well, cause uh, that bamboo has been up there for years, and so it's accumulated some, quite a bit of dust that's there to stay for a while. So tonight, I'm gonna call it a night. Thank you for watching, and if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, yeah. And more importantly, you guys, get up, get out, get active. You don't have to do what I'm doing, but, you know, see around your yard, look around your inside of your home. What projects can you do? You know, with coronavirus keeping us at home, 
you know what, this is a great time to sort of start getting into those projects that you, you know, held out because of work and you can't, don't have the time. I hung out with my father as a little girl, so I learned a lot from my father. And both my mother and father were hard workers, but because I hung out with my father, this is actually dedicated to him. Thank you for watching. Girls gotta go in, I'm tired. <laughs> Love you guys. See you on my next video.